If you've ever had the opportunity to cruise down historic Victoria Avenue in the city of Riverside, you know it's one of the prettiest streets in town. But behind the scenes of this tree-lined road, Western is hard at work gathering runoff water from rain and the nearby orange groves, farms, and homes that make this street so special. On the corner of Jackson Street and Victoria Avenue, you'll find Western's Recharge Basin. Despite your first impressions, it's not just a dirt lot. There's a lot more than meets the eye. Before Western built this basin, water runoff would quickly flow out of the area, making it unavailable to customers. Rather than allow that to happen, Western knew this was the perfect site to capture it and use it to recharge or refill the local groundwater supply. How does all this work? It starts with water from either rainfall or local runoff flowing into a collection area called the settling pond. From there, water travels down a concrete channel and is released into either the east or west basin. And now, it's time to recharge. The water collected in the basins seeps back into the ground, is absorbed by the soil, and makes its way into a groundwater aquifer replenishing and recharging this local water supply. Yep, it's hard to believe, but there's an aquifer about 200 feet underground located between the rock and layers of soil beneath your feet. The recharge process happens in nature, after a good rain or with water runoff. Western's basin is engineered to speed up the recharge process and return the water to the aquifer more quickly. Thanks to this process, our basins have the capacity to recharge up to 2,500 acre-feet of water annually. That's enough water to fill more than 1,200 Olympic-sized swimming pools. The more water we collect, the more local groundwater is available for you, our customer. The recharge basin is the first and last step to connecting the drops for Western's Riverside Service Area and creating a sustainable model not only for delivering water directly to you, but also storing water for future generations. <laughs>